Greetings everyone, welcome to the HR Clinic. This is the G-Spot and my name is Namile Bavili Lamini, the founder of G-Spot Consultancy. So basically, as I was marketing my page and asking people to, <laughs> to subscribe, um, I kept getting the question, why the G-Spot? How did you come about with the name G-Spot? Because they know it for the naughty things. Um, just to clear the air first, this is a very professional platform and we will, talking, we will be talking about everything HR and the workplace and organizations and begging the job interview tips and all of that. But this is just a rough um, idea of what will be happening in, the, in, the, in this community. So the just but um, initially I wanted to call it the Genesis because this is my first project. This is my first baby um, in HR. But as I like looked through the internet, I saw the G-Spot. I was like, hmm, this looks nice because firstly, the initial original G-Spot in the human body when we are transitioning to the sexuality and um, sexual aspect of the word, it means that um, the G-Spot is that spot that people always complain about and it's even funnier for men because it's in an awkward awkward space so i was like actually i can relate this to my platform because i want to talk about people's purposes like helping you find your purpose in life helping you reach your goals helping you identify why your imagination right runs so wild so a lot of times we just miss our career just spots because uh, we are chasing money, we just want to settle, we want to get bread on the table. So I'm just going to do anything and as long as I'm getting paid. But um, the real life is when you're doing something that you love, something that you're passionate about, something that you really are called for because we are all called to do something on this earth and it would be really nice for you to leave this earth having unpacked all your talent, having unpacked or lived your purpose to the fullest and having lived to your maximum potential so the gist what originally comes from that people missing the original initial word but i'm like people miss their career gist spots as well so let's just try to hit the career gist spot and give you a very beautiful life ahead and what is the purpose of this group i think i've just rum rumbled about it in my previous explanation of the name i'm hoping and trusting that I will help um, members of this community to reach their goals, to find their purpose mostly, and to do things that they are passionate about. So that when you wake up each morning, you wake up grateful instead of just dreading the day ahead because you don't want to see your boss today, but you could be your own boss even. But yeah, when we get to that point or that part of um, the platform, you will understand what I mean by that. And who's my niche market? Mm. Basically from, I'll just say, cause I can't uh, specify the age, from um, pupils or students from uh, grade 10 and up to ages 35 or 40, if um, that group finds the platform helpful. Why am I um, tackling that group? Um, from, from high school, I want to focus on the high school kids making making sure that the high school kids when they are done with high school they are choosing the right courses in varsity or if they want to venture into entrepreneurship or business i want to help them to realize that um, part of their being and if you're already working um, i'm going to be talking a lot about growing in a workplace and transitioning from a job that you were doing for the sake of doing it and helping you do the job that you really like or that you were really called for so that you love it right having said all of that as our first step towards a pursuit of finding our purpose and as a form of, a, as a form of an engagement um please just write one thing on the comment section that you can do and even if you were not paid for it but you can just do it because it comes naturally for me i'll make an, an example for me i love cooking so much so i can cook anytime any day anywhere because i love it so much and i feel like that's my purpose, that's my calling. I could open a restaurant tomorrow and could be up and running. So just write for me just one thing that you think 
you like doing and you could do it even if you were not paid for, for doing it and let's get engaging this will help me to know the kind of people i'm working it i'm working with excuse me my english bundles are depleting um it will help me to understand the kind of people i'm working with and so that i get an idea of the kind of um, information and content i need to bring into this platform otherwise you know the drill don't forget to subscribe share and comment and this looks the end of our first video to the loose end Goodbye! <laughs>